2019's legislative session saw the passing of many Bell-supported initiatives, such as minimum wage rule changes, full-day kindergarten, the Equal Pay for Equal Work Act, and bills aimed to lower health insurance costs. This year, there are five policy areas that will shape the 2020 legislative session. Universal portable benefits. As the economy and nature of work changes, many workers don't have access to benefits like health insurance, retirement plans, or paid family and medical leave. An immediate step to ensure greater access to these crucial benefits would be to implement secure savings retirement accounts. Types of people, not jobs, a universal portable benefit like Secure Savings helps Coloradans save, helps employers compete for the best talent, and helps our state build a strong workforce for the future. Financial equity and empowerment. The Bell Policy Center has fought against predatory economic institutions for many years, including leading the effort to cap payday loans. Many communities across the country have taken the next step by creating an Office of Financial Empowerment. Colorado could follow suit with a statewide Office of Financial Empowerment that increases access to financial education, safe and affordable banking and credit products, and methods to grow wealth in historically marginalized communities. Early childhood education. The high cost of childcare is a major barrier for families. As we focus on goals like guaranteeing universal pre-K, the legislature must create the broader infrastructure to support Coloradans who depend on early childhood education. 2020 legislators can increase recruitment and retention of early childhood education workers by raising wages and investing in career advancement opportunities. Aging in Colorado. Colorado is aging fast, but it's not just older adults who need support. Similar to the early childhood education workforce, the pay and benefits for long-term care workers don't reflect the importance of their jobs. Many of the solutions to increase recruitment and retention for early childhood education workers would have a similar benefit for the long-term care workforce. Legislation aimed at strengthening Colorado's caring workforce can ensure loved ones of any age and their caregivers are supported in 2020 and beyond. Fiscal and tax policy. A rich state with a regressive tax system, Colorado places the largest tax burden on hardworking families with low and middle incomes. This legislative session should focus on eliminating tax credits we don't need and putting in place ones that help working families while also making our tax code more fair. When it comes to transportation and education, an absence of statewide solutions means the legislature has no other option but to ask communities to do more to support local schools and implement new fees on emerging transportation technologies. As the 2020 legislative session kicks off, be sure to visit bellpolicy.org for updates on these issues and more.